Have you ever felt overwhelmed by your emotions or trapped by life's unpredictable events? Well, a former Roman slave turned philosopher might have some insights for you. Meet Epictetus, one of the most influential thinkers of Stoicism. Born in Heropolis, Phrygia, around 50 AD, Epictetus endured the hardships of being a slave in Rome. However, instead of letting his circumstances define him, he used them as a platform to cultivate resilience, discipline, and wisdom. The core of Epictetus' teachings can be summarized by one of his most famous quotes. It's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. At the heart of this idea lies a distinction between what we can control and what we can't. Think of it this way. While we can't always control external events, like the weather or the opinion of others, we can control our own reactions, judgments, and decisions. By focusing on our own inner sphere of control, we can maintain our tranquility and peace of mind regardless of what life throws at us. Epictetus believed in the importance of practicing philosophy daily, not just talking about it. For him, philosophy wasn't just an intellectual pursuit, but a way of life. This meant practicing patience, courage, and acceptance every day. But how we can apply these stoic principles in today's world? Imagine you're stuck in traffic. Instead of getting frustrated, a stoic perspective will encourage acceptance. You can't change the traffic, but you can choose how you respond to it. Maybe you see it as an opportunity to listen to a new podcast or enjoy some extra thinking time. Or let's say someone makes a hurtful comment about you. Instead of retaliating or dwelling on the remark, remember that you can't control other people's opinions. However, you can control your own reaction, opting for understanding or indifference rather than anger. One of the tools Epictetus recommended for cultivating a stoic mindset was premeditation of evils. This involves imagining challenging situations in advance, which can help us prepare emotionally and mentally for potential setbacks. For example, before giving a public speech, one might consider all the things that could go wrong. The audience could be disinterested, the microphone could malfunction, or perhaps someone might ask, a tough question. By preparing these scenarios in advance, the speaker can reduce anxiety and approach the situation with greater confidence. In essence, Epictetus and Stoicism remind us of the power of perspective. Life will undoubtedly present challenges, but by focusing on what we can control and accepting what we can't, we can navigate life with a greater resilience and joy. So, the next time life throws a curveball your way, channel your inner Epictetus, take a moment, breathe, and remember that while you might not have control over the world around you, you always have control over your response, and in that lies true freedom.